YouTube, it's Weird Paul. It's mail day again, and today's package comes from subscriber Jesse Shell of Shell Games. So let's take a look at what I got. First, I got a few rare Atari 2600 games that I've never even played before. I got the 1983 A Magic game Subterranea. This is in the original box. It's rated 6 out of 10 on Atari Age. That's rare plus. That's rare. In this game, you're a spaceship, and there's this strange monster at the bottom called a Hexuplex that sends Aobots up that you have to destroy. Once you get rid of those, you descend into a tunnel where you have to destroy all the enemies. Then you have to get past the Electro Gates. Whew! Then you keep descending and fighting, and it gets harder and harder. I also got the 1983 Zonix game, Tomark the Barbarian. This one's rated 7 out of 10 on Atari Age. That's very rare. That's rare. You're a barbarian, and you have to jump around avoiding mutants and bats while searching for the Sun Sword. Pressing down on the joystick takes you to the castle tower, where you control the imprisoned princess, who must use lightning bolts to protect herself from bird people. The goal is to find the Sun Sword, which I did, and then go save the princess, which I couldn't figure out how to do. Aww. And the third game I got is the 1983 Zonix game Motocross Racer. This one's rated 7 out of 10 on Atari Age. That's very rare. That's rare. In this game, you have to ride a motorcycle all the way to a mountain while avoiding obstacles. If you can get there before time runs out, you run up the mountain, and then you jump over dune buggies back on the motorcycle. Only, I could never make it to the mountain, even trying over and over and over and over. <laughs> Besides the Atari games, I also got three They Might Be Giant CDs that all came out in 2018. 2018 Live has live versions of classics like Istanbul, not Constantinople, and one of my favorites, Anna Ng. My Murdered Remains is a two-disc set, and I prefer the second disc over the first. But my favorite is The Escape Team. Lots of great melodies on this one. My favorite track is Chip the Chip. Jesse also sent me some cassettes. I got Frank Zappa, Hot Rats. Spike Jones is murdering the classics. The comp Elvira presents Vinyl Macabre. A Baby Snooks old radio tape. And Big Daddy. Awesome. I love these guys. They do doo-wop versions of 80s songs. And I got Steve Martin. Comedy is not pretty. And Jesse sent me one more thing. Actually, it's more like 50 more things. These are all cassettes of songs taped off of the Dr. Demento radio show between around late 1983 to 1990. <gasps> and it came with this dot matrix printed list of everything on the tapes. It was done with a Radio Shack Memory Mate database. I started listening to the Dr. Demento show in June of 1986, so I definitely heard some of these same shows that Jesse taped these songs from. Like, My Name is Not Merv Griffin by Gary Muller. My name is not Merv Griffin. My name is not Merv Griffin. My name is not Merv Griffin. My real name is yours. I definitely remember hearing Bacteria by Penn and Teller. Totally nude by The Wallets. Let's Make the Water Turn Black by Frank Zappa. And I'm My Own Grandpa by Lonzo and Oscar. All when they were played. And wow, I feel like an onion ring by Syntax Air. I made my own video for that not long after I heard it in 1986. This is a lot of amazing music. Some of it is very rare, and a lot of it I've never even heard. Plenty of entertainment. Big thanks to Jesse Shell for the very rare Atari games and all the demented music. And of course, I put the link to the Shell Games website down in the video description. I'll see you soon with more memories. Thanks, YouTube. Bye. Bye.